been recording for a minute and some change now and not realised that my microphone wasn't muted, it just wasn't being recognised by OBS. Thank you, OBS. I shall reiterate. Hi, guys. Um, this Coffee Time with Cobra is going to be a brief one. Um, I know my normal rules is I go until the coffee's gone, but I just need to give a brief explanation as to why there's been no streams. Um, mostly because I've not been well. I am on an incredibly high dosage amount of painkillers and antibiotics and a whole bunch of other stuff to figure out what this infection is that's in me, out of me. Um, my whole entire body is racked with pain. It's in my joints, it's in my muscles. It literally feels like my bone is on fire. Um, and there's absolutely nothing the NHS doctors can do. I've gone to three or four different doctors and appointments. I've had phone consultations, video conference consultations. Um, it's a very somber moment when you have to show your butthole to someone on a camera. Um, and it, you not get paid. Looking at you on your fans, girls. But it is 6am and I literally got woke up. Uh, after about four hours of sleep with my left wrist literally killing me to the point where I'm bed I can't bend it like this if that makes sense every time I try it is just immense pain immense pain uh, it kind of reminds me very similar to how I was struggling when I was using a right-handed mouse um, when I lived in uh, America and um I think that contributed to what I'm going through now. Mm. Even holding that coffee cup, I can feel the pain right through here. Right through my wrist. It genuinely feels like when I broke... When I was younger, I broke both my wrists um, on a BMX bike. Um, being in city bollocks and thinking I was the next X Games. You know, kind of douchebag and uh yeah i did a bmx tra trick landed i landed the trick that's the thing i landed the trick the trick was fucking awesome i landed the damn trick but the follow-up hill came up to me too quick because i was going too fast and didn't realize and didn't have time chance to well, most most of the time nobody ever had brakes on their bmx bikes but ow 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 i even hurt to scratch my head and um so i uh went over the thing and I jumped over the fence that separates the park from the walk from the, the pathway, landed, and like a city bollocks, first thing I did was I stuck my hands out. And so my entire body weight went on both my wrists and gave me two compound fractures in both my wrists. So, yeah, that was fun. Not. Uh, uh, ended up spending two or three days in pure agony because my mum didn't believe me that I'd hurt myself. Went to school, uh, woke up to try and put my school uniform on, and I legit could not bend my wrists in any direction. I couldn't bend them this way, I couldn't bend them this way, I couldn't do this, I couldn't do anything with my, this is my right hand by the way, I couldn't do any of that with either of my hands. And showed my dad my wrists looked like Popeye's forearms, and he immediately took me to the hospital, they x-rayed me and they said, yes, your son has two compound fractures, and here, here, and here, and here, here, and here. Um, literally, I compound fractured my wrist in two places, both wrists twice. So technically, I broke my wrists twice at the same, in the same accident. And so they said it's going to take an, a, a long time to heal because they can't. They're, they're they're not full breaks; they're fractures, and your body takes a lot a long time to heal a fracture, and it has a break, which doesn't make any sense, but it does at the same time. Um, and so. They literally put my arms, my, they, they put cold calm presses on my arms to get the swelling down. And when the swelling was down enough, they literally put half casts from here to my wrists on both arms. So I, I could not move my arms at all. I felt like 3PO. I genuinely felt like 3PO. I could not move my arms. Uh, I could move them at the elbows, of course, you know. But I'm just saying I couldn't move my from my forearms down. So from, from here down, I couldn't move. Um... And so people took the piss out of me in school and called me 3PO uh, for about a year. Um, and I couldn't run my BMX bike, which pissed me off the most because that was a really bitchin' bike. I loved that bike. Oh, I miss that bike. I 
I left it in Lincolnshire at my cousin's. It's gone now. But it was such a bitchin' bike. I loved that damn bike. That was that was the only thing that my dad ever bought me that I actually truthfully, deep down, fundamentally loved and took care of. And mine was Sky Baby Blue and my brother's was Fire Engine Red. We even had matching wheel spokes with white wall tires. Oh, love that bit. I would love to get one, like for an adult size. And now my silly bollocks, I'll probably think I'm fucking 10 again and try and do that shoot sort of shit and end up breaking my neck. But that's why I've not been streaming, guys. I've just not been physically well enough to stream. Uh, I want to. Um, now, another good news, I'm also uh, now got a NHS based therapist which means I will be doing a lot more anger management classes to help control my uh, anger better more than what medic medication can because the medication I'm taking right now is not exactly on par uh, there's been several instances where I've um, had to um, what's the word I'm looking for here mm, ha have a lot more self control than necessary, which is why I don't like being around stupid people. Uh, so I don't I don't suffer fools easily at all. I do not suffer fools easily. Anyway, guys, I normally do say the coffee's done, so the video's done, but I just want to make this a really quick one. So video's done, and I'll see you guys uh, hopefully today. If I'm feeding up to it, which is Saturday, is it Saturday? Saturday? Sunday. It's Sunday, uh, so so uh, no streams today. So I don't stream on Sundays. Uh, so Monday, hopefully tomorrow, I'll see you then. All right, guys. Till then.